Hello and welcome, my name is Fishdot, and today we are playing Battlefleet Gothic Armada. Alrighty. So we have one world going to be exterminated. Um, it's a planetary assault mission. Yeah, I'm not dealing with that. No way. Um, however, we have a data recovery mission that the Inquisition, where is it? Right here, needs our help with. And it's also a chaos mission, so I think I'll probably do it. And then we'll probably do a cruiser clash in Krinrock Sound. And then I don't know what else what we'll do for the other one but we have to recover the data um this might be a little rough not entirely sure how well we'll do but we'll take in the dream team as always and now the dream team is that much better And it looks beautiful. Gosh, I really like that black and white. And then the green. Oh, it's so beautiful. Okay, get the data out and or get the data and warp out. Um, it's this is honestly probably one of the more annoying missions. What? There we go. Game. Alright, where is he? Tell me. There he is. Everyone! Charge! Alright, you... Um, I'm not going to... Do a... Uh, yeah, I'll do it. Okay. No, it was decent. It'll do a little, zero damage. Oh, no, it did... Did 100 damage to the shields. Alright, so. Its speed is less. It has better running silent and it has belt armor. So that's a little bit of a pain for us. Um, we are going to try and just turn into it. Just get these torpedoes out. There we go. This is something that I realized. As long as they blinked, well, as long as they're blinking, it doesn't matter. So, as long as I blink and it's a safe zone to blink in when it starts, it's fine. They look like they have more cruisers than me. Which isn't good for me. So I'm gonna have to destroy one of them. Okay, they've wasted their lightning strike on me. And I'm going to do a true boarding action on them. Just because the true boarding action, I find, is better. Um, this is gonna likely lead into some... Hey, that worked! I'm kind of surprised. 
I was really expecting me to screw that up and hit the um you know okay yep I was expecting that unfortunately Um, actually, I can just lightning strike at this point. Resuming normal function. Your orders. Activating tactical All right. Kill him. Understood. Activating tactical we have taken a lot of damage really quickly, but whatever we still got a minute left before we can even warp out of here and that's really not good So we need to get over to this guy. Okay, he's turning around. Good. Enemy ship sighted. And there's another like cruiser, which isn't good for us. But we should be okay. Activating tactical cogitators. Oh no, he's Oh no. Do we have the Mezio? No, we don't. Replenish. Keep moving. Orders received. This is all I care about. Ship ready. Um, if I do reload, we should be able to. Changing course. And actually, okay. Not the best, I will admit. I mean, we did a bunch of damage, at least. Cruising speed set. Yeah, have fun with that one. Alrighty. We probably have this in the bag. Um, I'm actually gonna do this. Activating tactical Cruising speed set. Shoot, shoot, shoot. He can warp really quickly. Resuming normal Alright, we won. Information secure. Let's get out of here. Uh nope, don't warp out because Activating you might lose your you might get lost in the warp and I don't want that happening yeah we won this we have numbers on our side okay that's a little bit scary I'm very glad that we used the Cobra to great effect See, that's really the nice thing about the Cobra, you can just spawn it. Oh, really? This is really annoying. Because now that's lost in the warp. For two more deployments. And there's zero way of me getting I it up. I am dispatching an inquisitional agent to one of your ships. The agent is waiting for your assignment. At Port Moore. Thank you. You are to be commended for the help you provided us. I expect you to be as zealous in your defense of other operations of the Inquisition against the heretics. I assure you, Inquisitor, my fleet will do all that is necessary to purge the chaos threat from the Gothic sector. Yep. Everyone likes me except for the um Astartes, which are actually the ones that I was trying to save. Okay, well, whatever. Um, I'm going to let this exterminate 
because that actually helps us if you think about it in a slightly more convoluted way because we have limited deployments if this planet gets destroyed then we don't have to waste a deployment on it and because it's a planetary assault there's a pretty good chance we could lose this and I'm not willing to take that chance so we have a another data mission I thought we had a cruiser clash yeah we have a cruiser clash right here Okay, we will do this. Alright. Um, we unfortunately won't be able to bring in the Dream Team because we're missing our other cruiser, but we, we kind of have our replacement. He's our fill-in in case we have this issue. I personally would rather have my cruiser, but I mean, I guess I could have just destroyed the enemy, but I've had such bad luck with the data missions that I'm not really willing to risk that mission. Activating tactical cogitators. Because the loss here is actually really bad yes, Admiral. just because if you lose then you don't only just lose the whole well you don't lose that battle but you lose um, any ships you've lost Underway. in that battle because you probably lost it because you're destroyed Resuming normal or other reasons but you also lose that deployment. Your orders. And really, that orders deployment's received. huge. And, your and I'm sure the game makers decided, yeah, let's make these deployments really valuable. Yes, because that, that makes sense, to be completely honest. I mean, this feels like an actual, like, if we lose this, it's really bad for us. Alright, there are three ships here. Two ships over here. Hopefully we can destroy a ship or two here before those two ships get there. Um, there are probably a few escorts. That probably hit too. Activating tactical um, I'm gonna aim for the target where I'm gonna most likely hit something. That is only the smartest thing to do. Changing course. All right, I can just tell everyone to be a boarding action. Helm um, looks like there's a carrier here. Not like it's gonna do a lot of good here for these guys, but um, we missed that one. Looks like we might we might actually hit with two of them. Enemy ship sighted. Okay. This guy is taking a little bit of damage. Oh, it's a battle cruiser. Okay, it's also their flagship. Activating tactical cogitators. And then here's my battle cruiser. Um, I'm actually not going to have it bored. Understood. Unfortunately, they've limited my view. Um, but we have augers for a reason. Activating tactical cogitators. Oh. I knew I was going to waste the salvo there, so... Tactical cogitators. Well, that's a bummer. 
activating tactical cogitators. Oh, I seem to really like doing that. Understood. Activating tactical cogitators. All right, goal number one: destroy this loser. I very well probably will get a ram in here. Yeah. I'm gonna do it. Just because. Why not? Helm coordinates acknowledged. If we can destroy their carrier, well. If we can destroy their flagship before their fleet really comes into combat, we've basically won. Unfortunately, this ship has taken a lot of damage. And there's enemies all around us, unfortunately, too. Alright, I'm going to try and gun for the ship here. Because it has abilities. Not quite sure what... Oh, it's the... I know what it is. It's the Echo ship. It doesn't really do a lot. No. Enjoy, joy, sir. Underway. Hmm. We might lose this ship, functions. unfortunately. Yep. We definitely lost this ship. Awaiting orders. Activating tactical But we took out that ship, which is. It, yeah, there's no way the ship's gonna survive. Activating tactical Unfortunately. I might be able to Understood. get it out of here. Engines to maximum. But it's more likely that we're gonna lose it. Understood. Which is a little disappointing. I always hate losing a ship. Oh yeah, it's on fire too. Yep, you're dead. Sorry, buddy. Nothing I can do for you. Yep. Bye, bye. Yes, yes, yes. It's a sad day indeed. Hmm. No. Engines hot. I will definitely get the extra skill for this ship, though. Because that is just super powerful. Um, where is the enemy? Right there he is. Longer probe right there, so we can see him. Well, hi there, buddy. How are you? You just destroyed my generators. That's not nice of you. Cruising speed set. Acquiring new vector. Nope, he's definitely out there. Setting course. Ship ready. Oh well. Orders received. Not much could be new done. Orders. Engines hot. Activating tactical cogitation. Setting course. Activating tactical cogitators. Burn retros. Fortunately, this is actually going to do more damage to us than is dumb. Yes, Admiral. Yeah. Changing course. But, and it's not too bad. Activating tactical cogitators. 
Awaiting orders. Changing course. Especially since we are trying to kill him as quickly as possible. Course plotted. Activating tactical oh, good. Successful boarding. All right, do a 180. Orders received. Cruising speed set. Activating tactical cogitators. Okay, you're dead. Resuming normal functions. There we go. Changing course. Victory for the Imperium. Alrighty, I'm most likely gonna buy that destroyed ship outright again because well, he's part of our dream team, and we've earned 244, which is more than enough to repair a light cruiser, because I'm pretty sure they're either 50 each or 25 each. Pretty sure it's 50 each turn. Let's go find out as I go back to Port Maw, even though I've been like, yeah, Port Maw screen sucks. It's 18. What? Yeah, definitely repairing you. And then I'm gonna just go with that. Can I afford the favor? Oh, I probably could, but I... I oh wait, I've already got the favor on the ship. Hmm. What do I want you to be? I gotta say, I want this. Oh man, it's beautiful. Is ready. Beautiful. Alright, let's get an upgrade. Um, I don't think I'm gonna go with the Mezio Drive. Alright, you have the Plasma Bomb and the... I'm actually gonna go with the Supercharged Shield. Even though you have the plasma cannon, which I guess I'm more likely to use a plasma bomb with you being in this blast radius though then, so. Um no, I don't want an increase. The increase of uh, doesn't really make sense because Sure we can fire at nine thousand, but we're inaccurate as heck. We can barely hit all the time at 6,000. Um, this would be decent. Actually, armor piercing would be pretty good. Because this ship, and I'm pretty sure level 8's when we get another upgrade. So I'll be able to get another one immediately after this. Although he's not even close to being at level 8 yet. Soon he will be though. And he's stuck in the warp for one turn. Yeah. Only one. It's better than two turns. Oh my gosh. I also like how repairing a destroyed ship costs 36. Like whatever. 36 is nothing. Compared to two turns, that's six deployments. Which I mean, I yeah, it's that's a lot. But anyways, my name's been Bishta. This has been Battlefleet Gothic Armada. I've been just talking for the past four minutes, so I'm sorry about that. But if you've enjoyed the video, please remember to like and comment down below. Every like and comment makes me feel amazing about myself and tells me that I'm doing an okay job at my um, hopefully, job. So, hope you guys have a wonderful day.